Hey guys, this is me Triple Two Jaro, and welcome on my channel. I'm back with the pick a card reading, and topic of today pick a card reading is how does he feel for me? He or she, whoever you are watching this, uh, and you wanted to know about your love interest, if he, he if he, she, uh, there is no gender specific here. I will just pick up the energies here about your person. Okay, whoever your person is, current partner, ex-partner, your soulmate, your twin flame, whatever the connection you share with your person. So basically today Pika card dating is about how does your person, he or she, whoever they are, feel for you. Okay, um, I will pick up their energy, their feelings and where they are at right now, what's going on with them. And this is a time lapse reading. Whenever you will watch this, uh, if it resonates with you, then this is for you. So uh, this is a general love reading as you guys know that if it uh, resonate with you then all the better if it's not then these messages uh, are not for you. So uh, let's get started. Uh, you can see that three piles in front of you and with these beautiful stones out there. This is the pile number one. These beautiful blue stones uh, on this. This is pile number one. This is pile number two, beautiful yellow stones on this. This is pile number three, the beautiful green one big stone on this, okay? So whatever the pile is calling you about your love interest, you can choose that. I have to show you blue one, yellow two, and green three. So whatever the pile is calling you, just choose it okay so i will timestamp the video in description box so let's get started okay okay pile number one so let's get started the people who choose these beautiful blue stones out there um, let's see if your person is uh how they are feeling towards you right now what's their feeling i'm using uh this beautiful uh romantic tarot deck and then this beautiful earth angel oracle magic and this is romance tarot deck okay this is i will use it as a different okay now first see this person how this person feels for you okay how this person uh, feels for you basically their true feelings for you you have this beautiful moon card here it could be dealing with a cancer here okay that is the moon card cancer in moon are the cancer and then you have the hermit reverse number nine could be dealing with virgo here okay then you have this beautiful four of cups pisces cancer scorpio then clear by this moon card you have four of pentacles Okay, that is reverse by the way we are doing blue okay then you have i have to show you the cards over here okay clear by this hermit reverse you have three of sword reverse clear by this four of cups you have a nine of cups Isis, Cancer, Scorpio, could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I'm also sensing Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Virgo especially here, and the Cancer star is also here, okay? Now let's see about uh, the Oracle cards here, okay? The Earth, Magic, Oracle cards. What they say about it? New Moon, that is Promise. You can see the couple here in this card, right? new moon promise okay then you have the wheel that is breach hmm, jumping out look at all this person okay romance into those cards you have forgiving and learning okay then you have worth waiting for beautiful this is the beautiful energy here that you guys have okay so i have to show you you can see the what cards are saying about this person and what could happen between you and this person 
So, uh, what I'm sensing here with this, uh, the moon card, this person has definitely, uh, I feel, feelings for you. But I feel that this person never expressed their feelings towards you, what I'm sensing here. You can see that, right? The moon card here. The moon is back back here. Uh, someone is also could be live in the Paris. Uh, I'm sensing here because the Paris here. You meet this person in the Paris or someone is from Paris or France, okay? I also sense here there is a pet of dog. Uh, could be female has a pet as dog or the man has, okay? I'm also saying the... Mm, statue of uh, the man's like they have a hairy um, you know face uh, like they have a beard and mustache like that okay um, I'm sensing here okay let's talk about this person feelings they with the cancer in moon okay that is the moon card that is just sometimes it's deception I'm sensing in your person reading definitely whoever your person is uh, I feel they never express their feelings to you and for some of you, if, if they expressed it, but they never truly told you that how they feel. It looked like they uh, showed you in the some signs in some type of, uh, you know, like they, they give you hints like they like you or they have feelings for you. Or could be probably you know that, that this person has feelings for you. But this person never speak up like... Um, as, a, as I'm speaking right now, like that I like you, I love you, I have feelings for you, that type of thing I'm sensing here. I'm sensing, I'm sensing here with this, uh, the moon card cleared by four of pentacles, you guys. I feel um, this person will speak up their emotions at some point. It could be um, time limit will be four months. After four months or after four weeks, you will definitely hear from this person. Because what I'm sensing here, this person already know that they have feelings for you and they can't hide it anymore with the four of pentacles rewards here. Okay. So I feel this, you know, the four of pentacles upright mean that the person is not telling you and, uh, you know, whoever here is waiting for the other person to open up or speak up, but it's rewards here. So it means that definitely it's, so what I'm sensing here, definitely this person will uh, speak up. With the four of pentacles yours they will speak up their emotions and feelings i also sense here with the you know the four of cups here there is a missed opportunity here could be you offer this person love are you know are you really want to be with this person with the nine of cups definitely this person is your wish fulfillment like you really want to be with this person this person is like i want this person i have feelings for this person and i want to be with this person so four of pentacles four of cups for me here is like there was a missed opportunity this person uh, could be did not value your love your your sincerity your care in the back what i'm sensing here but they will realize that you are the one for them because now i feel that someone here left okay someone definitely here left uh, because they feel like it's it's because the other person was not opening up or it could be someone was tired of waiting someone also tired of like when this person will speak up when this person will talk to me when the, when this person will tell me that how they truly feel so i feel that whoever this person in this connection left the other person now realizing i'm sensing here that um, they did wrong and they're regretting it with the four of cups and they want to come back and with the four of pentacles you are here they want to speak now that how they feel okay because you can see that the hermit rewards here, okay, that is the Virgo energy. The hermit always look for, you know, it's, it's a, like introspection in yourself. You want to know the answers. You want to know something is unclear for you. You're looking for the answers. You're finding the answers. Uh, for some time, it's like spiritual growth is there. That is very important. That's also uh, healing very important. You know, individual healing. We all are humans. We have to heal first. Um we all have wounds from past or whatever the thing that is triggering us, that is disturbing us. So we have to heal from that. So it's reversed now. I feel this person already realized or they are awakened to this connection the, and that they did wrong. Because you can see that the next is definitely four of cups is here. 
they they finally realizing that they missed the opportunity with you they um they did wrong and i feel that with this you can see that the couple is here i feel that this person now want to come back and want to want forgiveness want want a second chance like uh, i know i screwed up i know i i was wrong and i want uh, to be with you now what i'm sensing here because you can see that the three of sword reverse here it's it's that was i feel that you both were definitely hurt in this connection not one person you both were hurt you both were hurting in this connection now this person is trying to heal whatever is happened it could be uh, there was a third party situation between you and this person and now this person is trying to get over this with the three or so reverse here it's healing it's just like whatever the heartbreak whatever the heart whatever the thing between you and this person was you know holding back coming together or something was there so now this person is healing properly and they are ready to come towards you i'm sending here because i feel with the 9 of cups this person now realizing that you are the wish for this person it's look like you both want to be with each other you can see that with the 4 of cups um you know clear by 9 of cups you both want to be each other and you can see the direction of like this is very interesting here you know the man is you can see the masculine whoever the masculine energy here in this connection i'm just picking up the energy i'm not seeing that uh, you know gender based here that male or female i'm just picking up the energy the masculine energy here is now realizing and they want forgiveness from feminine and they want to make things right you can see that the masculine here is now hugging back uh, you know the feminine like i was wrong uh, i i hurt you now i'm here and it's it's look like the wish is coming through nine of cups coming together and i'm also seeing cat here someone has pet as a cat pigeons also are so here you can see that the spiritual growth between you and this person these beautiful birds that pigeons it's it's a, you know it's a universe it's a it's angels protecting this connection and you can see the cat is for me is intuitive so i feel like intuitively you know that this person loves you has feelings for you but they did not somehow open up to you now this person whoever it is i feel that now they are realizing your worth they want to be with you with a nine of cups right they want to make things right and they want to tell you that how they feel what i'm sensing here i'm seeing the birds a lot of birds here you can see that so messages are definitely coming towards you very soon this person will message you send you message send you email like they will contact you i'm also sending here could be this is a long distance relationship because i'm seeing here foreign uh, you know like foreign uh, lands and foreign places here so yes this person feel uh, this for you like they they screwed up they did hurt you they regretting it they are sorry they want forgiveness and they want to make things right now right so you can see that the next you have the new moon promise so it could be the next new moon that is coming in your way um whenever you will watch this the promise is coming this person will promise you can see that the couple is here again you can see that right this person will make you promise like they will never do this again they will never do this again because this person is genuinely sorry i feel that this person is now genuinely wants to be with you because they feel like they they already did something wrong and you can see the clouds here black clouds and the dawn is here the sunshine is coming up i see the clarity is coming to this person they are awakening they are realizing uh, that they did wrong they screwed up now i feel whoever this person here is if they genuinely want to come back towards you at least if you want to forgive if you don't want to be with them then at least listen to them because they want forgiveness they want to make things right because everyone wants the different thing right it's not x it's the person that you love right this is for those people who love that person and they want to know that how this person feel for me you can see that the veil and breach you can see that the veil i feel that now this person this person did something wrong and we know that they they hurt you 
they screwed up, they, they did not value you, they ignored you, they rejected your offer, they, and they did not give you attention, the time, whatever the thing between you and this person happened. Now, this person want to jump out very, very soon. Like you can see that the, she's flipping up, the wheel is flipping up, reach like she want to um, just wants to get over from whatever the thing, whatever the situation is, they want to make this promise, this beautiful promise, like we will be together. I, I, I'm just, it could be this person is awakening again. I'm sensing you. You can see the direction of awakening, like their soul is awakening. Their their heart chakra is opening. Their kundalini is up opening, like they are realizing something. It's a big. I feel this person is also going through some transformation. You can see that. This is life changing situation for them. This is life changing for them because they are realizing that they did not value true love, true feelings of someone. Now, this person want to make things right and they're flipping up like they're getting over from anything that is disturbing them, third party situation, whatever the thing was, they are definitely don't uh, listening to anyone. They are just doing the things that is right for them. They will make a promise with you like uh, now I'm here, I'm sensing here. So again, you can see that forgiving and learning. Yeah, I told you, this person want forgiveness. I was telling you this and it's here again. This, part, this person definitely genuinely learned the lesson that what they did wrong and they were wrong. And this person genuinely admitting it, okay? Doesn't matter if she's, um, she's a woman or if he's male, whatever you are dealing with. Whoever this person was is your person, basically. They are sorry. They already learned that. They they. They already learned that what they did, right? And now they want forgiveness. Forgiveness means here that they want second chance. They want to make things right. They want to make things better with you. They want a chance. Like genuinely, I'm, I'm feeling here, this person want a chance. Like I will prove you that I'm not that person. They screwed up. You can see that this person is definitely also could be praying from the God that please, um, let me uh, let me give the opportunity to meet you, the viewer. You're watching this again. Like I want to make things right. I'm sorry. Could be this person has some issues. They have to heal. They have to deal. Could be this person has some problems. Uh, you know, related with the relationship, their family issues, something like that. So they were not ready at that time. I'm sensing here this person was not ready at that time when you offered them when you. Uh, you know, when you wanted something from them, they were not ready. Now they are ready. They are opening up totally. It's awakening. So this is beautiful thing here. I'm sending here. You can see that. What waiting for? Divine timing is at work in your love life. Yeah, I'm sending here again. This is divine timing. That I was, I was telling you that this was that was not the right time when you wanted to be with this person, when you wanted to make things right with this person. They were not ready. And now, worth waiting for. You can see the angels here. Their angels are telling you it's worth waiting for. This person is worth waiting for. If you are really, truly waiting for this person to open up, so you have to wait. They are almost there. They are, trans and they are into transition. They are trying to change themselves. This is a life-changing decision for them. And they are, for some of you, told you this person is totally different from you. And this is totally different, a big challenge for them to come towards you and speak up. Could be this person never did this, but this time they're just flipping up like, I have to do this. Otherwise, they will lose you. They know that. So what waiting for? Okay. So I feel that this person is definitely waiting for a right time also because the divine timing is here. They're tr I feel this person is already awakened and they're trying to, you know, solve things out they're also trying to heal things whatever the when they want to come towards you they just want to be with you like there is no issue no problem just you and me you can see that because they want to make a promise like we are now together no, now nothing can disturb us nothing can come between you and me you can see that i see the promise uh, you can see that the man is holding her the heart is holding him it's like we are here and we will be together right so beautiful energy here. So that was pile number one. If it resonated with you, like, share, and subscribe my channel. And like this video, I will truly appreciate it. See you later, guys. Hello, pile number two. Welcome on my channel again. I'm here with your reading. 
So that is the pile number two. The people who choose these beautiful yellow stones are there. Let's see how your person feels for you. Truly feels for you. I'm using this beautiful romantic tarot deck. Okay. And then this earth magical oracle card. And then this romance oracle deck. Okay. So let's see first this person truly how they truly feel for you. So you have the Hierophant, Taurus energy, could be dealing with Taurus, okay? Then you have five of pentacles, okay? More earth sign, more earth energy. Then you have two of sword reverse, okay? Clear by Hierophant, you have, wow, the lovers, Gemini energy. Then you have two of cups reverse. Mm -hmm. Then you have six of swords. Okay, I'm seeing Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini especially here. I'm seeing Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus especially here. I'm also sending here water energy. You can see that, right? And that is with the two of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Now let's see what earth oracle is saying about you waterfall okay that is effortless you can see that and then you have the music harmony okay let's see from uh, romance angels you have stay optimistic about your love life okay and then you have you deserve love because you are love able okay let me tune in this energy So, pile number two. What's going on? Okay. Let's talk about this. I feel uh, this person totally in love with you. Like, yes, they are. They, they feel that this love. But something happened between you and this person. You guys are not together. Yeah. Could be there is third party situation someone left you in the cold someone could be uh ghosted you and just got disappeared vanished like without even telling you that where they gone they were with you like for some of you i'm also sensing here this person could be um already committed with someone a married person that you're dealing with could be but the love is very very strong between you and this person i'm sensing here you can see that with this low energy i mean look at this how they are kissing like they don't care what's going on around them and they're just into each other so yes the love is from both sides like this is soulmate a connection i'm sensing here it could be twin flame because the lovers is here and also two, two of cups but this is also I'm sending here push and pull type of relationship. Someone is chaser, other is runner. The other is chaser and then runner. It's like running and chasing, running and chasing. And this relationship never gets stable. Like in and out in your relationship. This person definitely wants to comment with you. With this, you can see this energy with this, uh, by the way. The Hierophant and the Lover's Energy. This is definitely, this person wants to be with you. Like, wants to commit with you. Wants to be with you. Like, they are seeing you like, they can't leave you, by the way. They can't leave you, no matter what. If this person is still with you right now, or they are not with you, they can't leave you. Because they are totally in love with you. With you. And I feel you both are in love with each other. Very strongly. Madly. And deeply it's like you both have very deep emotions for each other and i also sense here that um, this is spiritual growth like you both are learning in this connection and i'm also sensing here this is uh someone is christian here and, and the other person i don't know there's some type of i'm seeing the difference of relig religions different of places different of cultures here but definitely I see that this is like, this relationship is for you like a personal growth, a healing, spirituality. If this is twin flame, like this is like in and out and 
I feel that now this person definitely wants to be with you. Like they want to make things right with you. That's uh, get stable with you, like with the Taurus energy, definitely. Now they want to stable the energy with you. Like it's, it's like this person is saying enough is enough. We can't do like this, run, 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 and never come together. What I'm sensing here with these five of pentacles that definitely you can see that the man is holding a woman. And five of pentacles definitely is in normal hair is it's just like feeling left alone by this person um, and uh, lost, okay, and feeling alone, like nobody's with me, this person don't love me, this person, like feeling lost, disappointed, regretted, and I feel that with this could be this person cheated on you, ghosted you, or they lied to you, something is there, that they, or could be this person just left, yeah. They left you in the cold, like, and this person also, I feel that gone through that period. Because the love is strong. If they cheated still on you, I'm telling you, for some of you, if they, if they lied or cheated on you or betrayed you, still they are in love with you. And now, with the Taurus energy here, they want, definitely wants to be with you. They want to talk with you, what I'm sensing here. You can see that the two of cups, it works. Yeah, definitely. For some of you, this is totally different. If this person, like, this person, two of cups reverse, they, they were not with you on the same page. They did not accept you. They did not love you. Could be they were with someone else. I'm telling you, this person could be committed with someone else or they are the girlfriend or boyfriend on someone else and you still have deep emotions for this person. So this person was never with you with the five of pentacles for some of you. Two of cups reverse and five of pentacles. I feel that they gone through this and you gone through this also. I feel like. Like you guys were not together, never meet together. Like you, you feel like this is unbelievable. This is impossible that you, you, you guys could be together because they are, if they are with someone else. But what I'm sensing here, it's, it's just like the clarity is coming. If there was, look, look at these two of swords. And two of swords are right. It's mean definitely it's like on the crossroad. Nothing is clear. Nothing is, you know, you don't know what to do. You don't know, um, your mind is going into circles and circles. Like you are not finding the answers. You're not finding the truth. You're also not finding the result and resolutions that what should you, what should you do? So with the two of sword reverse here, it's mean that something is coming on the surface, right? The, the, this person now finally realize, I know that what the truth is. They finally know that what they have to do because and they want to do with you six of swords want to talk with you i'm telling you look at this coming into you know in the calmer water and peaceful resolution talk with you they definitely want to talk with you like they want to communicate with you they want to make things right could be long distance relationship because in normal chair definitely six of swords is, is a person is uh, you know you know on the water so yeah i feel that long distance relationship could be this person will communicate with you or want to travel to see you visit you something like that they want to definitely want to heart to heart conversation with you like they know that they have to talk with you they can't be in that mind of state now uh, like like confused like what should i do what should i not they want to talk with you i'm sensing here with this um the hierophant and the uh, Lovers, some of you definitely was in a committed relationship with each other. I could be in commitment, could be in marriage. And something happened between you and this person, like you guys were separated, something happened. And now this person definitely want to talk with you, like have a conversation with you. Like they definitely is thinking about you. You are on their mind. They want to make things right. They want to end the conflict or whatever the argument something happened, confusion between you and this person, misunderstanding, whatever it is. It's like they want to come back because the love is very strong between you and this person. With the, um, I feel this person and now want to commit with you, definitely. They're planning about commitment. They're how they're feeling. Basically, their feelings is definitely want to be with you. You can see that the from the Earth uh, Oracle card here, waterfall effortless yeah i feel like that now this person is definitely flowing in the in this connection they want to go with the flow they want to feel uh, they want to definitely follow their heart because the water is here waterfall that is emotions feelings i feel this person is now coming towards you they want to see you 
I feel that greenery and you can see that there's something coming for you, like good news is coming from this person. Yeah, this person will speak up their feelings. They will. Because they want to talk with you. They totally want to talk with you. Like they want to discuss something. Whatever is happened between you and this person, whatever the scenario is, whatever the scene happened between you and this person, they want to talk with you. That's how. That's confirmed. They want to talk with you. Like they want to sit with you and want to, you know, heart to heart conversation. If they want to send you a message or they want to, you know, like face to face, they're talking. They want to sit and talk with you. Like they're saying, we can't, um, you know, like run, run, run away. We have to stable this energy. We have to stable and ground this relationship now. We have to find the solution, basically, they're saying. The music harmony. Could be your person is into music. They are musicians or they love music. They write something. They play some instruments like guitar, piano, like that, or things. Uh, it could be this is you. You are into music. You are artists. You are creative. Arts. Something is there related with the art and music. I could be the, you both are, uh, you know, I could be you meet this person uh, or they want to meet you again on the concert or you are meeting this person on the concert, something like that. Music is that is harmony, like music is definitely, you know, connecting you both. That is I'm sensing here. So you can see that uh, now harmony is also coming with the music, definitely. And this is also a meditation tip for you if you definitely feel down. Listen to the music, write something, read something into music, okay? So do something uh, related with the music because music will bring harmony in you. I mean, I mean to say that we, if you feel down, okay, this music will definitely make you uh, feel comfortable. So you have stay optimistic about your love life. Definitely, I feel that you are not positive about this or your energy is low or you feel like this person don't come. But angels and universe and spirit is saying to you that stay optimistic about your love life because positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Definitely, this person will come back. I'm sensing here that they are and they because the love is strong between you and this person. For some of you, this is totally one-sided. Okay, and now this person want to talk with you. And for others of you, it's look like you were together. You totally are madly in love with each other. Something happened between you and this person like separated. Something happened like boom. Everything collapsed, coasted, defeated. Like something happened. And now this person, you know, from nowhere will come towards you and want to talk with you. So stay optimistic about your love life. It's very important. Keep praying, keep manifesting this relationship. I feel that so... Faith, basically, and positive thinking will bring romance in your life back. Because you deserve love. You are lovable. So I, I'm saying again that you have to be, uh, you know, if you are not taking care of yourself, if you are not uh, feel like you are not worth it, you don't deserve love, you will never meet someone. So I feel that definitely each spirit is saying to you, universe, angels are saying to you, no, you deserve love. So you have to be positive that definitely you will get love. You will deserve love and you are lovable. We know that and we will give you, but on the right time, you have to clear your energy. You have to clear your uh, dark energy, your negative energy. Be optimistic, be hopeful about future, have faith because we are bringing this person back. We are bringing this person towards you, whoever your person is, right? So I feel that definitely they feel uh, totally in love with you and they want to talk with you. Like totally, they are absolutely, they are, they are thinking about you. They want to come and make things right and want to talk with you. That's how this person is feeling. But till then, they came back. You have to be optimistic and hopeful about the things that things will get better, right? So that is pile number two. Uh, if it resonated with you, like, share and subscribe my channel. Give the thumbs up to this video. Thank you so much. See you later. Hello, pile number three, the people who choose this beautiful green big stone. Let's see how your person feels for you. So I'm doing uh, this uh, beautiful uh, romantic tarot deck using and also this um, earth oracle cards and then this beautiful romantic angels cards. Okay, so let's see how this person, your person feels for you. So you have... Knight of Wands reverse, Aries, Leo, Art, Sagittarius. Then you have Seven of Pentacles reverse, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. 
then you have the wheel of fortune but it's reverse okay so clear by knight of wands reverse you have ace of pentacles clear by seven of pentacles you have what is this five of cups reverse pisces cancer scorpio the wheel of fortune reverse you have ace of wand more fire you also have earth sign taurus virgo capricorn and water sign and fire sign could be any sign because and also could be you're dealing with fixed sign specifically with the wheel of fortune that is scorpio aquarius taurus or leo let's see what's earth angel are saying to you fire passion definitely lot lot of fire you have love compassion wow this is beautiful then you have from okay you have it is safe for you to love open your heart and to give and receive the highest energy of all this is beautiful guys then you have playfulness to accept your romance allow your inner youthful spirit to fun to shine okay so right away i have to get over this energy give me a second this person how this person feel for you your person feels for you so let's talk about that knight of wand reverse clear by ace of pentacles so this person definitely wants a new beginning with you but you know like they're not taking action towards you and also they are showing you that they are not interested okay i'm also sensing here for some of you this is totally new person coming into your life Because I'm sensing here, for some of you, you have to give up on your past. You have to leave your past, heal from the past, whatever the karmic cycle, your situation in you are right now. Could be you are in your karmic partner with someone right now. And you have to leave that karmic partner, karmic situation. Then you will meet this person. I'm sensing very strongly here, the people who choose green hair. It's looked like you are right now in your karmic situation or come with karmic partner. I know people don't want to listen it. Karmic partner are very strong relationship. They are very, very intense. You feel like this is my soulmate. This is my twin flame. But this is the lesson for us. And when we learn that lesson, we, we have to heal from something. They learn the trigger our, you know, something, that emotions that we are definitely wound our, that we are carrying from our childhood, that we are carrying from uh, heartbreaks and something. They came up in our lives to teach us some lessons and the lessons of a life I'm sending here. So... For some of you, this is totally new person. You will meet this person, whoever this person has love and compassionate for you. And is a wand is of uh, pentacles, totally new. And this new person will totally new and safe for you to love. But first, you have to clear your karmic energy. First, you have to clear from your past relationship. You are in this person with someone it's look like you're waiting for someone for years for years for years um it could be months it's like and this person never take action towards you not coming towards you so they are saying clearly to you that it's time to give up on this person how long you can wait how long you can you know resist this new beginning new person that is already there waiting for you could be your soulmate is there, like your true partner, your true mate. And now with this playfulness card here, I'm sending here, this is socializing. This is like going into parties, going into events, like going on, going out, and you will meet this person. You have to be in a playful energy. It's very important right now because you are definitely meeting someone that you will catch the fire with that person and you will fall in love. They will fall in love. They will make the things right in your life because something is going wrong in your life. Like with this wheel of fortune reverse here, this cycle. It's like you are in a repetitive cycle with someone. Like you're waiting for this knight of wand to come towards you. Like you're waiting for, a, for some of you, this is totally a player for you. Because knight of wand is a player. Like they want to come into your life, then they exit. They in, they out. They in and out. 
or it could be the one night stand like they just came up into your life just for their own energy just for their own needs and they just got disappeared because this person love the to play with people they are play like they want to be into one you know they want this is like they want to be you know a lot of relationships because they are attracted for something whenever they attract something it's like they're not king obviously they're not king they are not like they they came and then they just go they they never stay so to you so you are waiting for this person like whoever this person is it should look like something good happened with this person uh that you you feel like this is the one this is your destiny and you will meet this person again but the problem here is this person is not coming towards you knight of wands reverse is like this is the waste of time like there is no passion in this connection i'm also sensing here that it's it looks like one person is waiting but the other is even not there it's like they're not even there in front of you like with you so you're waiting for nothing i would say that sooner you will end up with this person sooner you will heal uh, from this karmic lesson situation or partner definitely you will meet there definitely there someone is that is your true match true partner i'm i'm sensing here to be honest i'm not sensing here from this person that they can offer you something whoever that you ask okay i'm sensing here that you are the one always approach to this person you are the one always make the things right in this connection because i'm seeing here they are not they 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 don't see that this is the safe for you i'm not seeing here so you have seven of pentacles reverse right giving up okay and then five of cups reverse healing look at this i'm seeing with this combination like it's it's is like five of cups you already with the cheater you can see the woman again it's like you are with the player like they they could be they're not player but they played with your heart they have break your heart five of cups you were there crying sad disappointed waiting for this person but they never come seven of pentacles reverse it's mean that you were waiting for this person you are the one always approaching this person like now stop this they are saying stop this stop this heal from this okay let them go let let he your let let yourself heal from this situation because they are not i know they are not a wand they are charming they are charmer they are handsome sexy they have a lot of passion that's why you are attracted okay you see the fire in them you see the passion in them you you feel like there is something with this person but it's not it's just your just your illusion you can see that the karmic situation here the cycle is going on and on and this person never offer you something serious so i don't know why are you with this person um obviously this is very tough and hard situation right now you are in but i feel this person is not even coming towards you it looks like you can see that seven of pentacles five of cups you are nine of wands they are over they are already done with you they are doing their own things they are busy with themselves and here i feel that you are waiting for this person for nothing now let me tell you here positive thing here you have ace of pentacles new beginning something solid something stable safety security with the ace of wands it's here you know passionate new beginning someone new ace of wands new beginning look at the broader picture someone is there go out meet new people socialize yourself you will find someone that is true match that is your true match that can give you that what you want you can uh, who will who is stable who can be stable who can be passionate who can give you what you want you deserve basically this person can't give you whoever this knight of wands here is they can't and i'm sensing here when you meet the other person who will give you this security definitely you will catch the fire it could be fire sign could be water sign is coming into your life it could be earth sign but look at this this look like this, you will get the passion back in your life romance will come back compassion like two people are coming you know like you can see that how beautiful it is like two people are working now it's not like one person is, is making effort here it's like two people are here now together be with each other doing this passion compassion when the relationship have passion and compassion i mean this is a true blessings but i feel this is the new thing here new one if you will end up with this person if you will leave the 
or let go of the past a karmic cycle otherwise it will be repetitive again and again okay yeah this is your life i have to tell you so i'm sensing here it is safe for you to love open your heart and to give and receive the highest energy of you yeah, i feel that it is safe for you love whoever this person is new is coming in your life compassionate passionate i feel that they are safe for you because they are giving you this is of pentacles like something serious something stable they will be ground your they they will ground your energy they will be with you like also passionate doing things together like sharing things together like as you want they will be safe for you but you will get and meet this person when you will definitely um let go of the past release the past release your ex something like that the karmic cycles karmic cycles so you can relate that if you are in karmic cycle like in repetitive cycle waiting 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 in and out type of relationship so it's not good for you it's not healthy for you it's very important to now socialize and move on from that and you will find someone better because someone is still there definitely god is saying to you there there is a new opportunity there is a good people out there but if you want to wait for this person it's your life i'm sensing here they're not coming to you they will in and out in your life repetitive cycle they're giving up already give up five of cups because they're they're already cut you out from their life and they don't think about you but you are here stuck with them waiting for them okay so that was uh, that's how your person feel for you why they're not coming they don't feel anything they just move on and if you will be move on because i feel this is karmic situation or karmic partner um karmic cycles still going on so it's very important for you to move on to better find something be new something refreshing that you can be with someone stable someone passionate because it's here god is giving you the opportunity uh, of socializing going out okay like meeting new people then you will definitely find someone who will be safe for you to love this is not safe like coming out and going out like this is not safe right so i really hope it resonated with you like share and subscribe my channel thumbs up the video i will truly appreciate it see you later guys god bless you